In this video, we'll be discussing the top 8 diseases that are common among the elderly. These conditions tend to increase with age, but the good news is that many of them can be prevented. By understanding what these diseases are and how to reduce your risk factors, you can significantly improve your quality of life as you age. To help me cover all 8 diseases, I'm aiming to get 8,000 likes for this video. Your contribution means a lot as it helps the video reach more people and encourages me to continue providing valuable information for free. I hope you enjoy watching and feel free to share it with your friends. Number 8. Osteoporosis is a disease that causes weak bones. It's caused by bone demineralization and can be detected in the initial phase with a bone densitometry exam. There are two types of osteoporosis, primary and secondary. Primary osteoporosis is when you have low levels of calcium and other minerals in your bones, which leads to thinning and eventual breakage. Secondary osteoporosis is when you have low levels of calcium and other minerals in your bones because of medications or from diseases such as cancer or kidney failure. If you're over 65 years old, it's recommended that you get screened for osteoporosis every year specifically at ages 65 and 70 for women, 70 and 75 for men. If you have risk factors such as smoking, a sedentary lifestyle, or use of corticosteroids, however, it may be wise to start screening earlier than this recommendation suggests. You can also prevent changes in your thyroid with diet and exercise. A regular weight-bearing exercise program like walking on a treadmill or running will help keep your bones strong so they don't lose density over time. You should also limit alcohol use because it can lead to weight gain and make it harder for your body to absorb. Number 7. Osteoporosis and thyroid disorders are prevalent in the elderly population. It's important to note that the symptoms of thyroid disease can vary significantly in older adults. For instance, hyperthyroidism, characterized by an excess of hormones T3, T4, may not present with the classic symptoms of tremors, agitation, and weight loss. Instead, it may manifest as arrhythmia or atrial fibrillation, which underscores the importance of routine exams like TSH and T4I to detect any hormonal imbalances. Thyroid disorders can alter other systems, such as blood pressure regulation leading to hypertension in the elderly. Hence, thyroid disease requires special attention and investigation through regular screening. The best way to prevent osteoporosis is by exercising regularly, one hour per day, and maintaining a healthy diet rich in calcium, two to three servings per day. Additionally, patients should consider taking vitamin D supplements if they have low levels, 200 IU slash day. Number 6, dyslipidemia, changes in cholesterol, and triglycerides are also crucial to monitor in the elderly population. Cardiovascular diseases are the leading cause of death in the elderly, and cholesterol levels play a critical role in this context. High LDL or low HDL levels are risk factors for heart disease and necessitate early detection through cholesterol exams. Like thyroid disorders, dyslipidemia may not present with noticeable symptoms, making regular screening essential. Simple lifestyle changes such as dietary modifications can reverse high triglyceride levels, which are also commonly seen in the elderly. 5. The importance of detecting vitamin B12 deficiency in the elderly. The elderly population is also a high-risk group for vitamin B12 deficiency, with up to 20% of individuals experiencing this condition. As people age, their stomachs lose the ability to produce an acid necessary for the absorption of vitamin B12, which can lead to a range of issues. Anemia, fatigue, and weakened heart function are common symptoms, along with neurological changes such as forgetfulness. Vitamin B12 deficiency is also a reversible cause of dementia, highlighting the need for regular testing in the elderly population. It is important to note that even those who consume meat regularly may still experience a deficiency due to absorption issues. This can result from an inadequate diet, an inability to absorb the vitamin, or a higher need for it during pregnancy. Fortunately, treating vitamin B12 deficiency is relatively simple, however, early detection is key to avoiding serious consequences caused by this condition. Number 4, urinary tract infections are a common condition that can affect the elderly population, but unfortunately, it often goes unnoticed. It is important to be aware that urinary tract infections may not always present with the classic symptoms of pain, and instead, the only symptom could be an increase in urinary frequency. If you find yourself waking up several times during the night to use the bathroom, it is crucial to investigate the possibility of a urinary tract infection. This condition can have severe consequences if left untreated, including kidney damage and sepsis. Therefore, it is vital to seek medical attention promptly if you suspect a urinary tract infection. Urinary tract infections are caused by bacteria entering through tiny openings in your bladder or urethra, 
the tube that carries urine from your kidneys out of your body. These openings are called ureters. They look like vertical pipes with a bulge on one side, the bladder, and another on the other, the opening into the urethra. These openings are very small and easily blocked by even small amounts of debris or mucus, so it's easy for bacteria from outside your body to get inside and cause an infection there instead. Number 3, Depression and Anxiety Disorders are prevalent in the elderly population, affecting more than half of seniors. However, these conditions are often overlooked and undertreated. It's crucial to pay close attention to changes in mood, behavior, and overall well-being in the elderly. Depression and anxiety can have significant impacts on a person's quality of life and overall health, and early detection and treatment can make a world of difference. Depression is one of the most common mental illnesses experienced by older adults. It's also the leading cause of disability worldwide. Anxiety disorders are also prevalent among older adults nearly one-third of people over age 65 have experienced symptoms of an anxiety disorder at some point in their lives. However, only about half receive appropriate treatment for these conditions. In addition to improving treatment rates for depression and anxiety disorders, early detection could help reduce the risk of other conditions such as osteoporosis that are commonly found in older adults who experience these symptoms. Number 2, Diabetes is a widespread health condition among seniors. It's crucial to understand that type 2 diabetes can be asymptomatic in the early stages, which makes it even more critical to have regular fasting blood glucose tests. However, some classic symptoms of diabetes, such as unexplained weight loss and increased thirst, should not be overlooked. Moreover, seniors should also be vigilant about other signs, including slow wound healing and foot changes. Monitoring these changes and getting diagnosed early can help manage the condition and avoid serious complications. The number one health concern for older adults is high blood pressure. The danger with hypertension is that you might not experience any symptoms until it's too late. So, it's crucial to have your blood pressure checked regularly, and it's not just a one-time thing. Track your blood pressure over time can help your doctor identify any trends or changes, which can guide treatment decisions. Uncontrolled hypertension can lead to serious health problems such as stroke, heart attack, and kidney disease. So, take control of your health and make sure to monitor your blood pressure regularly. When was the last time you checked yours? Let me know in the comments, and if it's been a while, I encourage you to make an appointment with your healthcare provider today. I hope you found the information in this video helpful and informative. Remember, take care of your health, especially as you age. Don't neglect any symptoms or warning signs, and make sure to regularly check in with your healthcare provider. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and sharing it with your friends and family. Your support means a lot to us, and it helps us to continue creating content that can make a difference in people's lives. Thank you for watching.